In this video, we're gonna make a quarter pipe skateboard ramp with no vert and a nice little deck on top. First thing you do is you've gotta take a piece of plywood that has half inch thickness or better and cut the sides of the ramp and I'll okay, show you. Okay, so here's how you draw the curvature of the ramp. First thing you have to attach, in this case I use a Sharpie to uh, use as the marker and I attach it to the end of just like a broom handle that I had. And then I, on this end, I drill a hole through the broom in order to put a nail through and this acts as an axis for the pen to turn. All right. Then I just, at the top of the board up here, nailed it. And you just allow that to swing along on that nailed design. Okay, it actually was like this. And then when I got to this point, I just put a straight line out from where the curvature left here out to the side to eliminate the vert right here because I didn't want to have any vert. So that's how you make it. And if you use if you do it like this, where you put the curve on the inside and on the inside here, you can use one sheet of plywood to do both sides and have it be longer on this side than this side. Okay, so I got two kinds of screws here uh, to use. One is for the decking on the ramp itself. There's the size of that one compared to my finger. And then this one's for combining the sides with the support beams. And it's about you know, twice as long as it is. Just two kinds of screws. Okay, we got two panels of this quarter inch hardwood plywood. It should be more rigid, more flexible, more weather resistant. And uh, we're going to stain it. But we got two sheets of this to use on the deck. And we're now going to move okay, on to the next Okay, here's the finished product after we have nailed all the side supports on. In our case, we made this ramp the size of a, the width of a piece of plywood, which is 48 inches. Then we had all the two by fours and four by fours that we used to just attach the two sides together, cut at lows to 47 inches exactly. We used half inch plywood, so filled in that additional. Now we've, we've just pressed our two hardwood plywood sheets, quarter inch plywood sheets against it and got a measurement. We're gonna trace that line along here and cut it. And then we're gonna put down our first sheet of plywood. 